What is going on, Collectors Optical 20 back for another video preview. Today, we're going to take a look at Green Goblin upgraded suit from Hot Toys. And you can pre-order this when it's available at BigBadToyStore.com. I'll put the link down below. I apologize in advance. My voice is kind of funny, a bit under the weather, but it's all right. I mean, I got to make an exception for, for Green Goblin. Man, decisions, decisions. I haven't pre-ordered anything since, you know, it feels like there's really no, you know, no uh, incentive on pre-ordering. So I didn't pre-order Green Goblin. Boy, this looks good. I mean, now the decision is, should I get this or the other one? There are two different goblins, though. The first one that they announced, that's more nostalgic, you know, in the beginning of the movie. Or you can associate it with Spider-Man, you know, from Tobey Maguire. This one, you know, it just looks good. Plus, you got that head sculpt. That looks amazing. Why do you got to do this, Hot Toys? I mean, I'm, I'm kidding right here, but boy, this and look at this glider. It's great. I mean, you got the LED light up function. It kind of folds. That head sculpt looks great. Plus, it does have the separate eyeball rolling system, or I want to call it purse still. It, I mean, it does have the battle damage. It does say there it's accurate. Um, I don't care if it's not accurate. It still looks good. Look at his legs, how far back he is sitting on that glider. I mean, you see on the um, leg area, kind of like the uh, folds and whatnot, but that still looks fantastic. And the overall suit, it feels like it's more streamlined compared to, you know, the older version of Green Goblin. I mean, this looks fan. This looks great. And and honestly, if I bought, I is it a Toys Era or So So Toys, whatever the case may be, I would probably get this if I had that. You know, at least this is totally different figure, right? From what you're going to get because you already have that. If if you bought the Toys Era one, the glider or whatever the case is, you could get this, get the head sculpt, put that on, you know, put it back and forth. But boy, from the smile, the wrinkles, the gap in his teeth, uh the eyeball rolling system, Man, this looks great. This looks great. Now, oh, you can even put the goggles in. You put the hoodie on. Uh, you, you got some different looks in here. Could you get away with just this? I mean, you. I guess you could. Maybe buy the head sculpt or a third party might do the, you know, the regular green goblin um, from the other suit. But I, I would say this, though. I, I don't think it's crazy to own both and i know it's probably going to be expensive and I, I trust me i was ready to go all in on no way home anyway i was um but this just yeah i think gonna, i'm I, I think i'm gonna buy both because i can't skip the first one that is so nostalgic and you can post that with spider-man you know the toby Maguire one and then this you could post this you know with um, Tom Holland, but yeah, that head sculpt is amazing. I mean, the hair is, uh, you know, it's, it's plastic, but it's not, it's not too bad. You know, it's, it's kind of throwing me off because the, the way the face looks, just the face is so realistic, you know, but look at from this afar. I mean, this, this, it's him. It's Willem Dafoe. You know, it's amazing, man. I, I think I'm going to get the Spider-Man too. I, I had no intentions at first of getting that. What do you call that suit anyway? I forgot already. The hybrid of of the Iron Spider slash, up, slash upgraded. I had no intentions of getting that. Maybe I'll get that last, but I'm just excited for the villains and the two other Spider-Man because I have... Tom Holland Spider-Man. I have Iron Spider. I have the upgraded suit. I have the stealth suit. You know, 
So getting this is just icing on the cake, but I think I'll buy that last. I, I'm willing to gamble on that one. That if I don't get it, you know, I still have the iron spider, so I'm I'm pretty okay. But man, this this upgraded suit, green guy. I don't know why it's upgraded. He looks like it's just torn in battle damage and all that stuff. Um But see, we we kind of call this. I'm I'm not gonna take credit for it. I think we everyone called it that everyone from No Way Home is pretty much gonna get ma get made, with the exception of Lizard because he's just a unique figure. Like we we all know, Hot Toys not about that life. They're not gonna you know do another figure. At least with this, they have a base. You know, like which is Green Goblin. Maybe the glider, they have to tweak it a little bit here and there. The suit looks like the same material and all that stuff. But I can't believe that they went all out and, and have purse on this figure. And I think it just brings more life. It's such a great idea to give him a purse. And he's not, is he even a DX? He's not a DX. Um, to, it's such a great idea to give him purse. They could have easily made him with that, those goggles. It made it removable have the eyes fixed like this but it just gives so much character when you do have that purse you know like moving around i i like the expression as well i'm glad they went with that expression it says here highly accurate suit with fine details and battle damage i mean you can see it all over the figure it's it's great with a glider and all now i'm guessing this is going to be a little bit more expensive than the regular green goblin just because of the head sculpt and the purse or the surf, whatever you want to call it. I'm guessing that's going to be a little bit higher. Um, I, let me look at the website. And then there's LED on the glider, like like on the other one. But I don't think there's like a deluxe or non-deluxe version. Yep, there isn't. So this is just the only one right now. And yeah, I'm guessing it'll be like $20, $30 more. Or maybe $40. I don't know. I don't know how much surf costs. But okay, let's put like $40 more or $50 at most. I still think it's pretty doable. I I think it looks great. I mean, you got the glider, you got this amazing head sculpt, uh, new body and all that stuff. So let me know in the comments. Are you guys excited about this? Are you gonna go all in with No Way Home like myself? Uh, gotta gotta save some money because it, you know I don't even know which one else is coming. You know I know we're yet to get the pre order for um, Andrew Garfield, but. Is there anything else that that you feel like it's coming from No Way Home? This is like, I don't know, Christmas for Hot Toys. But thank you for watching, guys. Hopefully you like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. And I will see you in the next video.